I'm Christina Tozzi. Now, tis the holiday season, it's all around us, and boy, do I have a few little gifts for your home kitchen. I am dreaming up how to re-inspire and reinvigorate how you make a bowl of cereal at home using ingredients that you probably already have in your cupboards. One of my favorite recipes is called the Berry Olay. It starts with Kellogg's Frosted Mini Wheats. They're dense, they have this great texture, they capture a lot of flavor. Those go in a bowl, fill it to the top, don't be stingy. I like to add berries, specifically raspberries, to this bowl of cereal. Raspberries are tart, they're fresh, they're bright, they have a great pop of flavor, and the Frosted Mini Wheats really help capture that flavor. From there, I amp up the flavor a little bit with some ground coffee. That's coffee before it goes into the coffee brewer. You can also use instant coffee. Now, this is going to add some real texture, some real depth of flavor, a little bitterness, which seems risky, but it's really gonna wake up your taste buds in the morning. The only thing that's left is some milk. For the Berry Olay, I love to use Milk Bar's cereal milk, which already has a sweetness to it. It already tastes like what's left in your bowl after you eat a bowl of cereal. Pour a little bit of that milk over. Seems easy enough. Now, the secret to this bowl of cereal for me is that you can kind of let the milk and the cereal steep together a little bit because those frosted mini wheats are really going to capture the flavor of that milk as it steeps in. And the cool part about this berry Olay recipe is that you can really put your own twist on it. If you're a real blackberry fan, a real blueberry fan, that works great in a bowl of cereal like this as well. I love strawberries and pomegranate seeds in place of raspberries. And if you're not a coffee person, you can totally use ground tea leaves in place as well. The only thing left to do is take a really big bite. Perfect. <laughs> 